Many residents and doctors do not know the correct method of eliciting capillary refill, also called as the capillary filling time. This video shall demonstrate the same. It is the time taken for filling of the capillaries once they have been emptied by blanching. It suggests whether or not the perfusion is adequate. Basically, it denotes perfusion of the superficial capillaries. Normal value is less than 2 seconds, but earlier this cutoff was taken to be 3 seconds. It is a very integral component of evaluation of a newborn. To elicit it, first select a site which is rich in capillaries. It is sternum in newborns because the skin in newborns is too thin and the capillaries in are easily visible through the skin in them. Also, the pulp of finger in older children can be used to elicit CRT. Now apply superficial touch for 5 seconds, remove your fingers and count the time in which the blanched area recolorizes, that is refills again. Now the issue is that most of the people just guess the time as 5 seconds for blanching and 3 seconds for recoloring and this leads to fallacious interpretations. So how do you count the seconds? Count like 1001, 1002, 1003, 1004, 1005. That is 5 seconds for blanch, 1006, 1007, 1008, that is 3 seconds for ripple. 1001, 1002, 1003, 1004, 1005, 1006, 1007, 1008. This is the video of a 28-week premature on ventilator. Remember, the count between the blanch and the refill, that is between 1005 and 1006 should be done in continuation and here is that most of the people falter. Now have a look in another video. 1001, See, the refill has occurred before we could count and finish saying 1007, that is in less than 2 seconds. So this is the normal capillary refill. Now delayed capillary refill can be seen in conditions like severe dehydration or shock, hypothermia, metabolic acidosis, severe sepsis and peripheral vascular disease which is uncommon in children. Also remember that capillary refill is brisk in warm shock while it is delayed in cold shock. This happens because the pulse pressure is wide in warm shock while it is narrow in cold shock. Thank you and do share the knowledge.